Welcome to our video on the 8 best foods to stop high uric acid. Today we're going to talk about some pretty awesome totally natural ways to help you keep those uric acid levels in check and of course boost your general well-being. Now what's this uric acid stuff you ask? Well it's a little something our bodies produce when they break down purines which are just naturally hanging out in certain foods. But here's the deal. When uric acid levels get out of control, it can lead to the not-so-fun condition called gout or even cause kidney stones. But no need to fret, we've got your back, and we're all about making it super simple and delicious to get those uric acid levels under control. So get ready to dig into our list of 8 incredible foods to put a stop to high uric acid. Now you might be wondering, what's behind these high uric acid levels? Well, when we've got an overflow of purines hanging around? they decide to break down into waste products like those pesky uric acid crystals. These little crystals have a thing for building up around joints or other tissues, causing some not-so-fun inflammation and pain. Now, purines aren't all bad. They're found naturally in some foods, but they can also sneak in from other sources like certain medications or lifestyle habits, such as going overboard on the alcohol or being a bit too cozy with the couch instead of getting some exercise. But here's the cool part. Some foods are like little uric acid busting superheroes. They've got properties that help take those uric acid levels down a notch. Hang tight because we'll dive into those tasty options later on. Let's get to know uric acid a bit better, shall we? Uric acid is a byproduct that occurs when our bodies work behind the scenes to break down those purines. These purines hang out in specific foods and drinks like red meat, organ meats, seafood, and alcohol. And like we said earlier, this results in unpleasant gout. Interestingly, having high levels of uric acid doesn't necessarily guarantee getting gout. Some folks can have high uric acid levels and never deal with gout, while others can get it even though their uric acid levels seem normal. It's a bit unpredictable like that. Studies have also hinted that high uric acid levels might be related to other health issues like heart disease, high blood pressure, and kidney problems. And here's the plot twist. It's not entirely certain if uric acid is causing these issues, or just hanging around as a marker for something else going on in the body. That raises another important question. Why does our body even produce uric acid in the first place? Turns out uric acid isn't just a troublemaker, it also plays some essential roles too, and that includes fighting off cell damaging free radicals as an antioxidant and it helps keep our blood pressure in check by boosting nitric oxide production, which keeps our blood vessels nice and calm, so it's all about balance. Some amount of uric acid in our bodies is helpful, while too much is harmful. Before we dive into our list of 8 incredible foods that can help you manage high uric acid levels and maintain a balanced lifestyle, please do us a favor and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to give that notification bell a friendly tap so you'll know when our latest videos come out. That way, you can live your healthiest, happiest life. Okay, let's get started with number eight, whole grains. These nutritional powerhouses often don't get the credit they deserve, but let me tell you whole grains are a wonderful addition to a well-balanced diet. Think about brown rice, quinoa, and whole wheat bread. These are your secret weapons against high uric acid levels and the looming threat of gout. Why, you ask? Well, these whole grain wonders are jam-packed with fiber, which acts like a bouncer. It's not afraid to roll up its sleeves and kick out that surplus uric acid. In fact, a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition showed that consuming whole grains is a great way to cut down on excess uric acid in the body. And here's the icing on the cake. A study published in the Archives of Internal Medicine found that men and women who indulged in more whole grains had a lowered likelihood of gout. Now whole grains aren't just about purging uric acid. They're also packed with essential nutrients like B vitamins, magnesium, and selenium. These are like the tools your body needs to build its health fortress. After all, it's not just about getting rid of uric acid, it's about giving your body the right ingredients to flourish. Now here's a great idea for a tasty treat a quinoa salad that hits the spot and fortifies your health. Here's the recipe. Mix cooked quinoa with a rainbow of chopped veggies like bell peppers, tomatoes, and cucumbers. 
Then, give it a zesty kick with a tangy lemon vinaigrette. This dish doesn't just delight your palate, but also a genius way to sneak whole grains into your system. And as a nice side benefit, you'll keep those bothersome uric acid levels in check. That's a win-win in our book. Number seven on our list is water. Let's give a big shout out to water, which is often an overlooked ally in the fight against high uric acid. Sometimes the best superstars are right under your nose. Hydrating is a surefire way to give excess uric acid the boot, which in turn helps you keep those gout attacks to a minimum. So, if you've been slacking on your H2O game, it's high time for a change. A study published in the Journal of Rheumatology revealed that chugging more water was linked to lower blood uric acid levels and cut down on the likelihood of getting gout. So, before you think about chugging down a soda or some other sugar-laden drink, Consider having a nice, crisp, refreshing glass of water. Get yourself a trusty water bottle. Keep it by your side so you're ready when you're feeling thirsty. Your body will thank you, and you'll be on your way to saying goodbye to those stubborn uric acid levels. At number six, we have coffee. If you're a coffee aficionado, listen up. It turns out that your morning java or midday pick-me-up just might be your secret weapon against gout. Surprising, right? Check this out. A study published in Arthritis and Rheumatism found that folks who sipped on four or more cups of coffee per day had a jaw-dropping 40% reduced chance of getting hit by gout, as opposed to people who skipped the coffee train. Now here's the kicker. Caffeine seems to be the MVP here, stepping up to help lower those pesky uric acid levels and put a lid on inflammation. But wait, what if you're not exactly on team coffee? No worries, you can still cash in on the perks by incorporating coffee in your usual recipes. For example, you can mix together some coffee grounds, brown sugar, a dash of smoked paprika, and a sprinkle of black pepper. Then, generously rub this flavorful concoction onto your favorite meat or veggies, and get ready for a grill session that'll blow your taste buds away. So, whether you pour that extra cup of coffee or give this zesty coffee rub a shot, it can turn the tide against high uric acid. Let's move on to number five, veggies. We're talking about veggies that could be your secret weapon against high uric acid levels. Think kale, spinach, and broccoli. These are the superheroes of the veggie world, and they're a force to be reckoned with. Why are they so special, you ask? Well, they're bursting with vitamin C, and this vitamin is like a superstar when it comes to taming uric acid levels and keeping inflammation in check. Take a look at this. A study in the Journal of Rheumatology revealed the magic of vitamin C. It showed that folks who loaded up on more of this vitamin had lower uric acid levels in their blood. Now let's dive into a mouth-watering way to enjoy veggies like a broccoli and kale salad. For starters, throw in some fresh broccoli, kale, cherry tomatoes, and a dash of red onion. Then, give it a flavor boost with a dressing made from olive oil, zesty lemon juice, a hint of garlic, and a dollop of Dijon mustard. Not only is this salad a visual masterpiece, but it's also packed with uric acid-fighting vitamin C. But hang on, there's even more goodness in the pipeline. Studies have hinted that these nutrient-packed veggies could be your shield against other health concerns, like heart disease and different types of cancer. That's why going green is a great way to keep gout out of the picture and protect your health in general. So. The next time you're cruising the supermarket aisles or checking out your local market, don't forget to stock up on these amazing veggies. Moving on to number four, tofu. All right, let's dive into the world of tofu. But before you dismiss this food as a bland and unexciting plant-based protein, hear me out. Tofu might just become your new best friend when it comes to taking those uric acid levels down a notch. But how exactly? Well, there's some pretty intriguing research suggesting that picking plant-based protein over its animal counterpart could be a game changer, helping you kick uric acid to the curb and lowering your risk of gout. So let's give tofu a round of applause. Here's a juicy tidbit. Research published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition reveals that guys who made the switch from animal protein to plant-based options like tofu saw their risk of gout take a nosedive. That's something to keep in mind. If you're all set to explore the wonders of tofu, here's an irresistible recipe to tempt your taste buds. 
Whip up a sizzling stir fry with tofu and toss in a vibrant mix of fresh veggies. We're talking bell peppers, crisp broccoli, and zesty onions. Then, serve this delightful concoction over some nice and warm brown rice or fluffy quinoa. It's not just a feast for your senses, it's a low purine, nutrient packed meal, so why not give tofu a shot? You might just change your mind about this plant based wonder food. Number three, berries. Great news for all you berry enthusiasts out there. Berries like strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries are not just delicious. They are packed with antioxidants and could be your secret weapon against inflammation in the body, and that's a real win for those grappling with gout. Here's the scoop. A study featured in the Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry uncovered that munching on blueberries worked wonders in cutting down uric acid levels in animals. But it doesn't stop there. The International Journal of Molecular Sciences suggests that strawberries have their own anti-inflammatory superpowers, making them a fantastic choice for folks dealing with high uric acid levels, or gout. Now picture this, you kickstart your day with a mouth-watering berry smoothie bowl. Whip up a delightful blend of your favorite berries, toss in some creamy Greek yogurt, and add a dash of almond milk, and some honey. Pour this delightful concoction into a bowl, then sprinkle it with some granola, sliced almonds, and a generous handful of extra berries. Now you've got a party going. Those antioxidant-packed berries in your bowl might just be the inflammation-fighting champions your body needs. And let's not forget about the treasure trove of vitamins and nutrients they bring to the table. These are essential for your overall well-being. There's even research in the Journal of Functional Foods that reveals raspberries, similar to blueberries and strawberries, are brimming with anti-inflammatory properties and possess an arsenal of antioxidants, making them a valuable asset in managing inflammation-related conditions. Number two, nuts. Let's talk about everyone's favorite crunchy snack. Whether it's almonds, walnuts, or cashews, these little delights are not just tasty, they're also bursting with healthy fats that can work wonders in taming inflammation within your body. They're also heavyweight contenders in the battle against high uric acid levels. Believe it or not, some studies have suggested that going nuts over nuts might just be the thing for bringing down those pesky uric acid levels. For example, in the Journal of Nutrition and Metabolism, there's a study that covers how munching on almonds led to a noticeable dip in blood uric acid levels. If you need an idea for a delectable nut-based snack, try this one on for size. Yogurt parfait with berries and nuts. All you need to do is layer Greek yogurt, fresh berries, and a generous sprinkle of chopped nuts in a glass. And before you know it, you're enjoying a healthy breakfast treat or midday snack with amazing tastes and textures. Best of all, you get the inflammation fighting and uric acid lowering benefits as part of the package. It doesn't get better than that. Finally, let's reveal our number one food, pineapple. Ever thought of pineapple as more than just a tropical delight? Well, this pointy, exotic fruit is more than just a pizza topping. Pineapple is actually a valuable ally in the fight against high uric acid, and it's all thanks to a special component known as bromelain. According to research, this enzyme could help you push back against high uric acid, thanks to its anti-inflammatory qualities. One animal study published in the journal Evidence-Based Complementary and Alternative Medicine found that bromelain can cut down on uric acid levels. Now that doesn't mean you need to be a pineapple farmer, but you'd do well to infuse more of this fruit into your diet. Research from biomedicine and pharmacotherapy points out that bromelain showed promise in reducing uric acid levels in rats, sparking interest in further exploration of the effect of this enzyme in humans. When it comes to keeping gout at bay and managing high uric acid levels, it's all about adopting a lifestyle and diet that are kind to your body. That means staying physically active, maintaining a healthy weight, keeping your alcohol intake in check, and ensuring you stay well hydrated. Plus, make friends with fruits, veggies, whole grains, and low-fat dairy products while giving those high purine troublemakers like organ meats, red meat, and seafood the cold shoulder. Now, you might be wondering about canned foods such as sardines, liver, kidneys, and various organ meats. Well, not all canned foods are guilty of raising uric acid levels. 
but it's still wise to check food labels for any purine friendly ingredients before putting them in your cart. But even if you're currently struggling with gout, don't lose hope. There are a variety of lifestyle changes you can implement to manage your symptoms. That includes getting enough fluids, weight management, being more active, and sticking to any medications. While gout might not be reversible, it can absolutely be tamed with the right approach, be it lifestyle changes or medications. Team up with your trusted doctor to craft a personalized treatment plan that suits you to a T. Here's to a healthier, gout-free you. If you found this video informative, show us some love with a thumbs up, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more invaluable content like this. And if you're so inclined, go ahead and hit that super thanks button. And of course, please share this video on your favorite social media platform to give your friends and family some new insight on lowering uric acid. Thanks for tuning in, and here's to a day filled with health and happiness.